Hi, if this is your reading, you could be dealing with someone who is very emotionally dry. They're rigid and they don't express their emotions. Even though they may have deep emotion, it's not something that's easily expressed. But this is a card that is really showing they have strong emotion to the point of obsession. They can't move on. They haven't been able to move on or move forward without you. But this person over here is feeling betrayed for some reason. Even though they're the ones that held back their feelings and they didn't come forward with their truth, they are feeling betrayed in the situation. They've been tempering themselves and holding back. They've been extremely patient and they're waiting for divine guidance, but they do know that this is meant to be. They know that you are someone either of their past or of their past life, and they do feel a special connection with you that they do not feel with anybody else. But there is something in between this happiness feeling of a soul connection, twin flame, everything that they want with you, and this happiness. They're locked, they're bound, and they can't reach this or this because something is keeping them tied and bound. This is a card of imprisonment, mental imprisonment. It could be an overprotective, possessive, jealous person or situation that is keeping them from what they know is meant to be for them. And this is something that will ultimately resolve in happiness on every level, emotional happiness, financial stability. This is having everything. And that's right here on the other side of this, but they're just stuck in this place right now. But as soon as they get out of this mental imprisonment or out of this, uh, the clutches of someone who's possessive and jealous and doesn't want to let them go, then they'll be able to reach this and um, experience this, which they know to be true, and this happiness. And this is financial happiness and financial abundance as well. Okay, I'm getting a different message. This person could feel betrayed by the universe. This person could feel that why... Am I not able to be with the one that I truly love, I truly feel for? And this could be a plethora of reasons for everybody. It could be something different. It could be religious differences, upbringing. Um, maybe one person is older or younger than the other person, different religious backgrounds, different social class, just things that are really not important and really shouldn't be getting in the way of love. But that is that thing that's holding them in this place and they feel bound. But sooner or later, they are going to break of it, be break out of it because this is an, an obsession. I'm having trouble speaking. So this person may have trouble speaking their truth to you. And that's a characteristic that is common in the emperor card okay normally i shuffle but i was guided to take the first three cards off the top so this person they are going to come forward they're going to come forward and they're going to plan this out and offer you something of stability this is a pinnacle so it's something practical they do want to take the next step with you because they feel you're the empress and this is the counterpart card to the emperor it's the empress so you may have got it all going on on your own and you're sitting in your spot but they're coming to you and this is a younger fiery male